Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to GTA San Andreas and our 100% playthrough, where today we are taking on the first Zero mission, which is called Air Raid. Now this is um, potentially going to be an issue. The Zero missions I always found very, very difficult when I was younger. They, uh, they have a lot to do with sort of remote controlled planes and things like that, and they can be really hard. So we're going to go ahead and do the first mission. I think we have to buy the place first for 30,000. 30,000 big ones to do some very painful missions. Yeah, seems like an amazing time. So um, let's go into Zero's RC shop and we will get our first mission. Hello, Carl, it's Zero. Oh, hi, oh there see? we go. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission, deep into enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure, whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Don't worry about it. I'll drop in soon. There we go. Um, I forgot you had to do it like that. So, this is going to be Air Raid. And you're going to see why I don't really like this mission very soon. Because it can be a major pain. Hey, what up, Z? Nothing is up, Carl. Apart from my blood pressure. And the imminent <laughs> collapse of my hopes and dreams. Why? As usual, the forces of darkness have triumphed over good. Life is nothing but misery, briefly interspersed with agony. I think you've been a little bit extreme there, man. You need to reduce the dosage. <laughs> Excuse me, but I never... I like the Vice City figures we in the background. drugs are for losers and or sex maniacs. And right now, sex is the last thing on my mind. Thank God for that. Berkeley is back. <laughs> oh, Berkeley. Yes. Who the fuck is Berkeley? Just a man I once beat in fair competition. A man literally obsessed with revenge. Oh, you put hands on him? No, please. <laughs> I never initiate violence. Oh, I know. You knocked his bitch. Uh, no. <laughs> I won the prize in the science fair. <laughs> oh. The first prize, that is. The science fair, of course. And now you want to pop you? <laughs> no. And they say gangbangers is petty as small minded. Hey, what's that bleeping sound? That's him. We shall fight to the end. Here we go. Berkeley is getting his revenge, and we've got to stop him. Berkeley's launched a full scale attack. These missions this are quite cool, insanity. the Zero ones, like the concept All of them, but they're frustrating as hell. He's going for my transmitters. So Berkeley's going to fly his little remote control planes and try and take out the transmitters. No problem, and we've got to stop man, him. They're, only toys. they're not toys. They're just smaller. <laughs> so we've got to use this minigun here. But actually, this is flipping difficult. Um, as I said, I spent hours and hours of my life as a kid trying to do this and failing badly. The problem is... Berkeley has so many of these things and they pack a punch when they drop their little bombs. Um, so I am going to struggle with this and I am going to have to do this countless times. I can tell you that already. Because it is just not, this is not the type of mission that I do well on. Anything that involves sort of very accurate shooting with a gun with a timed limit and things like that. Not not my thing. Not in my skill set, really. I don't have the patience for it, for a start. And probably the skill, either. So you can see, he's already doing a fair bit of damage. Oh, that was a good shot, to be fair. I don't do many of those, but that was quite a good one. But yeah, this guy, Berkeley, has got so many of these flipping planes. I can shoot. Shut up. Hold your flipping noise, Zero. But yeah, as I said, 
he's got so many of these things. Oh god, I've lost a transmitter already. This is uh, not going amazingly, is it? Come on, that had to have hit it. It's coming back for another pass. Oh god, we are in trouble here a little bit. Basically, you have to hold off the assault until the time limit runs out, but, um, yeah. We're not doing very well. And the amount of planes this loser has increases as well by the as the time goes on, so... Alright! Shut up, Zero. You're putting me off, man. Making me lose my concentration, dude. Trying my best here. It's all I can do. Uh, yeah, we're in quite a bit of trouble now. I've got 30 seconds, and it's gonna blow up. You, you! Ah, all the transmitters were destroyed. We'll try again. Bogey's at 12 o'clock. Okay, round two. I'm going to give it another go. Whether or not we'll do it on the second attempt, I don't know. I mean, I really doubt it. But we'll give it a go. I mean, this could take me flipping hours. Come on, I must have hit that one. Thank you. So, yeah. Um, second attempt. Not feeling optimistic. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep giving it a go. We've got to complete it to get the 100%, so that's the bottom line, isn't it? How many remote control planes does this dude have? Seriously. It's just crazy. It's pretty cool, though, <laughs> that they have this sort of thing going on because of their science projects like won the science fair so Berkeley's got to get his revenge by bombing the hell out of some sort of towers that Zero's built I mean it's ridiculous but it's kind of funny at the same time isn't it I mean like I said it's a cool idea for a mission actually having to shoot down remote control planes with a minigun is it's kind of fun it's just frustrating and difficult but yeah a pretty unique mission really and and, and all of the zero missions are, are pretty unique when you think about it um, I think there's three altogether and they all involve this kind of crap um, I won't go into what the other ones are just now because it's a little bit distracting for me uh, but yeah they're all pretty cool as concepts uh, we're doing a little bit better this time I'm not going to get ahead of myself just going to keep trying to concentrate on the task at hand I'm sort of getting to grips a little bit with the minigun's controls, I guess. But it only takes one little slip up, and these planes are going to wreak havoc, so... Got to really pay attention and keep taking out these flipping remote control planes which are coming in. Um, what are we doing for time? 12 seconds to go. I think we might be relatively safe here. We've lost the transmitter, but we've still got three left, and we've got like three seconds. And we have done it on the second attempt. Not too bad at all. As long as we have opposable thumbs, we will fight you. Yeah, Berkeley. Well done, Carl. Now leave. I must prepare for the battles ahead. <laughs> Never have so few owed so many. Too little three. No, that's not it. What is it? We will fight him on the beaches. Well, 
rooftops. <laughs> Fair enough, man. Mission passed. Three thousand dollars for doing that. Not the greatest prize in the world, is it? But not to be sniffed at, I suppose. Um, yeah. I mean, it's quite a fun mission, but just annoying as hell. I did enjoy it, now that I've completed it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we've got to have some more Zero-related madness coming up in the next couple of episodes. Uh, but that is going to do it for this one, so we're just going to quickly take a look at our stat screen now. And we're up to 35.29% complete. So it's coming together quite nicely. Uh, but that is going to do it for this episode, guys. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.